morning guys um, so today's Sunday uh, we are up early we packed everything well I just gotta finish packing everything put our bags back into the bags and stuff like that uh, we got a wedding to shoot today so this should be very interesting very fun so Indian wedding and um, these guys can usually go really nuts on the dance floor so we want to capture all of that um, what we're doing today with four of them as well as you're taking photos and doing a video for them as well so it should be cool um i'm just here waiting for the team to arrive now so we're all gonna meet here and then maybe hopefully if they come on time we'll have time to go for breakfast before we head out uh over to the bride and groom's house so i guess that's it um i'll see what i can do throughout the day to film bits and pieces but i don't think i'm going to be logging a lot just because um, I don't think it's very professional to be dog when I'm actually getting paid to shoot a wedding. So, mm, but I still want to keep you guys updated, and hopefully one day we'll have a, a crew to maybe follow us behind the scenes and um, actually capture everything for us. Hey, eh? one day, one can we hope? So yeah. Hi. This is almost six years ago that we met at Tinan. We are just having fun under the sun. No, we're not. What's um, very hot. I'm gross. Alvin's gross. Yeah, I'm hot. Gross. Very hot. <laughs> oh, the limo is just about to leave. So we're about to join them for the photo shoot. So catch you later. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, sorry. Oh, wait, we can take out the boot here. Yeah, you This is this is Josh. Um, so basically, we shot his wedding ages ago. And we had lots of fun, and now we're shooting their wedding. I think they're somehow related. That's my cousin. Yeah, that's his cousin. And this is my other cousin. And they're both cousins. I'm not related. I don't know, I don't know if that works, but, uh, but yeah. Check it, so we're halfway to this photo shoot. That's Pete, it's Marvin. Um, we are walking towards the next location. We technically had three, but now it's um, down to one. And we haven't had lunch, but it's all right. We're gonna get a really good dinner, I hope. But we are done. So we're just heading out. Um, Only you and the bride got to wear it. We're heading, heading back to the venue for the reception now. Which is pretty cool. It's the bride party behind me. Yeah, yeah. Yo, yo. So we are sort of in traffic and what have we done? We've done the photo shoot, we've, we've done, done the the walkway of weddings. Um yeah we've done the photo shoot, we've done everything. Well we yeah. were supposed to go to three locations, we ended up in one and ran out of time. What was the other location? Uh we were supposed to go to Flinders Street and oh, wow. something else. That's a bit, yeah. it's, it's quite um it's confident. Yeah and then so now we're heading over to the venue, which is uh, interesting because it says it's on the river's edge and Google yeah, Map right. can't tell us where we're actually going or parking or anything like that. So should be interesting, um, but it should be a good party tonight. And dancing. Some dancing, which if we get time we'll show you a bit of dancing, a bit of stuff happening, what happens at a wedding, I guess. Um, I mean, I wonder yeah. if it, is it, is it going to be full Bollywood dancing? Is it I don't something know. Sort of different kind of? I'm, I'm, I, feel like, I feel like I might have a stereotypical view yeah, same, of, what, of what Indian dancing is. Same. You know? But they're all like second or third generation though. Like, this is Pete with his Bollywood dance. So yeah, I mean, that could be totally insensitive. No, no, we're not trying to be insensitive or anything, we just are normal people, I guess, <laughs> being 
normal. I feel that's gonna be an education. No, the last the last time it was very very funny because I don't know. Watch the video, you'll find out. This is Bonaboo. Well our version of Bonaboo anyway. And I'll show it to you, I'll show it to you. Check this out, this is the bar room. They basically put two chairs there. This is the car park. This is the door to the car park. I'm not kidding. Over there. That's the lift. And then that's the kitchen. Very detailed. So yes, if you want your bridal suite to be part of the kitchen and car park, book this venue. They got amazing food that is so dry, look. Look at the sauce, it's so dry. Like what we got here, the sauce is so dry that it's stuck to the plate. I can't even scrape it up with a fork. Yes, normally I don't do this, but for your own good, don't put your wedding here. Oh, by the way, and the manager was really rude as well. Cheers. 